Sam the Busker's Dog, Chapter One, About Me, The Cavalier King Charles Spaniel. Greetings, lords and ladies. My name is Sam, and I am a royal dog. Indeed, I am a king, and not just any old king. I am a cavalier king, though who Charles Spaniel was, I have no idea. I have never met him, and neither have my family. I am very regal, as you can see in this picture. Well, of course I am. I have royal blood in my veins. Every owner of a Cavalier King has a photo like that. It's in the breed, you see. We even look royal. It's not just our dignified demeanour. Here is my colleague Farley demonstrating exactly what I mean. We are exceptionally pretty dogs and add to that our delectable personality and exquisite deportment, we are a winning combination, intoxicating our owners with intense tickles in their tummies. These tickles then soar from their tummies into their hands, which cuddle us and fondle our silky ears. And we like it. Well, of course we do. I was such a cute baby that my mistress took lots of photos of me. I am even on Facebook. I am so famous. Here I am as a wee pup. I am posing my best Cavalier King pose at the tender age of three months. And if Charles Spaniel, whoever he is, could see that picture, he would be very proud of my delightful royalness at such a young age. Even my wee freckles are turning into marvellous spots. My master tells everyone I am a certain type of Cavalier King. A Blenheim, no less. And because I am a Blenheim, I have free entry into Blenheim Palace whenever I want. So, that makes it official. I am in line to the throne. And, according to my pedigree, my grandmother was a noble dam called Blenheim Countess. So I am definitely an aristocrat, even though my mistress tells everyone I was cheap at £350. I mean, what's in a price tag when I am so splendidly gorgeous and exceedingly magnificent? On a human level, though, I'm not sure whether I'm a Sam called dog or a dog called Sam, but it doesn't matter. I respond to both names. If my mistress says to me, off dog, I move off the sofa quick because I know that someone is going to sit in my spot, which means I can then jump back up and sit on top of them and get cuddles. For, as everyone knows, even Wikipedia agrees, it is a well-known documented fact that Cavalier Kings are affectionate dogs evidenced by our insatiable desire to be hugged, stroked, kissed, cuddled, pampered, patted and petted. Oh, and we love everybody. And I certainly am hugged, stroked, kissed, cuddled, patted and petted by all kinds of people when I go out on the streets with my master. So, enough about me. I will now tell you a bit about my master and his busking. But first... I thought you might like to see this Cavalier King Wordle. 